At this place in history, we're in Castleton with Executive Director of the Vermont Historical Society, Steve Perkins. What are we chatting about today? Oh, we're talking about crude oil, Texas tea. Here in Vermont? Well, you know, <laughs> we're going to talk about exploration and specifically the guy who developed the modern oil drilling technique. Okay, so who is he? So his name was Edwin Drake. He was born right across the border in New York around 1819. But he grew up here in Castleton, lived on a farm right off of the modern day Drake Road. And industrious as any Vermont farmer is, learned his way around machinery and what to do. But later in life, he went on and worked on the railroad and he was a conductor. But ultimately, due to health issues, he semi-retired to Titusville, Pennsylvania. Titusville is where the oil industry really started in the U.S. And now they weren't using oil for locomotion too much at the time, but saw it as a way of uh, replacing whale oil. So the first stuff they started doing was uh, refining this sludge that just kind of naturally bubbled out of the ground into kerosene. But this industry really started to grow and said, how can we more efficiently get this oil out of the ground? You know, Edwin Drake uh, had an idea. He said, let's take some, uh, you know, well drilling techniques and see if we can get oil. And so he started drilling, but the sand and everything just kept collapsing around this. And, you know, this is 1858. Everyone's kind of laughing at him. You know, this isn't going to work. This isn't going to work. He had a great idea. He said, what if we take iron pipes and we drive them down into the ground in 10 foot sections? So you drive a 10 foot pipe down and then you screw another pipe on top and you drive it down. Once you get to bedrock, then you start drilling. Sure enough, in 1859, hit oil and they could attach a pump to it. It was a hand pump and they could pump that right out and they stored it in an old bathtub and they still use the same technique today. Oil drilling, um, they drive pipes and then they drill down through and it keeps the um, sand and dirt from collapsing. So people think oil and they think money. Did it make him a very wealthy, successful man? You know, it really didn't. Huh. Um, he was working for the Seneca Oil Company and uh, they made a ton of money on this. Um, uh, he was comfortable, but you know, died soon after in Bethlehem, Pennsylvania. But his name goes down in history as the guy who invented modern oil drilling techniques. And there's a museum if you want to go visit down in Pennsylvania, the Drake Oil Well Museum, and you can see some of his early inventions. At this place in history.